And good afternoon. This is Eric Tallman in the newsroom. We have breaking news that just came in in regards to a mom charged with killing her newborn son. And we're going to go to Channel 7 Action News on NowDetroit.com. And this is the report that we just received. You see the woman accused of killing her newborn baby and stuffing its tiny body in her desk at work. Stephen, that story is truly heartbreaking. That young mother charged with killing her newborn son sent quietly in court facing the judge. And now Detroit's Jonathan Carlson is live in Redford now with the latest details on this tragic case today. Jonathan? Well, good afternoon. She turned herself, she turned herself in, rather, but the judge showed no mercy on her, keeping her in jail. Kimberly Pappas faces murder charges after investigators say the 25-year-old gave birth in a bathroom at Siva Logistics in Redford. She then placed the newborn boy in a bag and stuffed his body in her desk drawer. When co-workers discovered blood, they called 911. Pappas soon claimed she had a miscarriage and led police to the child's body. Her attorney says she acted in a panic and she's suffering from mental health issues. And you could see her on the video screen. It was pretty flat. Um, there's issues. There's serious issues there. She uh, had nobody help her deliver that baby, and her attorney says that she kept her pregnancy pretty much a secret from everyone, including her own family. We'll have much more coming up at 5. For now, we're live in Redford. I'm Jonathan Carlson, the Now Detroit. All right, so and thank you, Channel 7 Action News, for that breaking update. And this is Eric Tallman giving you that news report, ASAP. Uh, we need as many responses as possible on this breaking story. I would like to hear from you, and please comment and uh, let me know uh, what you're thinking and uh, your concerns. Uh, we will have this available for you ASAP, and it will be available within minutes. Thank you very much, and have a good day. And this is Eric Tallman in the newsroom with all breaking news, weather, and much more. And like always, we're taking action for you. And we'll have much more uh, breaking news. If we receive any, we'll bring it to you a as soon as possible. Thank you.